Hey guys, welcome back. Yeah, I look the same because I am filming back to back. But anyways, I'm pretty sure you guys seen the title of the video. I'm going to be sharing with you guys a Ulta beauty haul. And I also went to, um, I ordered some things from Juvia's Place as well. I got this big old Ulta box right here. I, like I told you guys in my vlog, I did order my very first perfume. I don't have any perfume, okay? Like, I don't have any luxury perfume, so I'm excited about this. I have a perfume tray with no perfume on it. So, I'm excited. But, I think with um, the time when I ordered this stuff, you can get a free robe or a free blanket. And I chose the robe. And then, like, I actually got two free makeup bags. One of the makeup bags came with a mini size of the same perfume that I ordered. And then I also got another free makeup bag with just samples, which I'm going to run through really quickly. But um, this bag is, is ugly. Like, why do they think this was okay? Like, no. <laughs> but, yeah, I think if you spent like $80, to pick which makeup bag you wanted. But this bag is ugly, child. It's stuffed to the max with all the product that you can get in the makeup bag. So, anyways, we're just going to run through here. Um, I got the Chloe Nomad... Um, perfume i haven't smelled that yet um you get like a mac lip sample in here ruby rue mac red and cockney they actually have the shade cockney at uh, marshall's i think or tj maxx i believe i saw that shade nars climax um uh, mascara this look like a decent size i'm gonna open this right quick oh yeah that's like a decent size can't wait to try that out um this is from the brand Olean dual detox mask oh that's the little jar um what oh, girl so this is the philosophy micro delivery dream pill so i guess it's like a exfoliant pill or something i have to see what it is Re what refining gel i don't know this i keep dropping stuff this right here, I can't do nothing with it. This is um, for people with blonde hair. This is from the brand Dry Bar, so I don't know. I will give this to my coworker, but her hair is not really blonde. I don't think it's blonde. I don't think it's like blonde, but I don't know. This is the Shiseido Essential um, Energy Moisturizing Gel Cream. Oh, it's kind of like the smell. That's the product. Oh yeah, that's a nice size. So I never tried any uh, Shiseido products. So yeah, I get to try that. Um, Milk and Honey Intense Hydration Cream, Skin and Co Whip Cleansing Cream. I got a nut. What? What is this? Um, Kills Clearly Correct the um, Dark Spot Solution. I'm definitely gonna try this, even though I know it's not enough. But it might be. Oh yeah, that's a that's totally enough to try. But yeah, I want something for my dark marks because I have to conceal today. The mask is just tearing my face up. Um, this is the Rusk Pure Mix Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, I have this Pore Professional Pore Primer from Benefit. I think I maybe have tried this in the past. I'm not sure, but anyways, that's the cute little sample. Um, I got some hand cream. But this is Burberry um, London drink. Well, I guess the perfume is called Her. But yeah, I'm going to have to smell all of this when I get done. Another mascara from Clinique. Yeah. Oh my God, I missed out on getting my free mascara. Not mascara, but my free Clinique foundation. I'm so mad. Like, I was able to get a free mask foundation and I missed it. The reason why I picked this bag was because I wanted the Laura Mercier um, translucent powder. I do have it in the deep shade, but I wanted to try it in um, this shade. So, yeah, that's all I need because I got a lot of setting powders. This little, this little, girl, this ain't nothing. <laughs> this is just one time use Clinique Moisture Surge Intense. I don't even know why they waste their time. And this is from and this is like a shampoo, conditioner, and serum type of hair set. Another perfume, Versace Bright Crystal. I want to try this. And I love the packaging. It looks so cute and girly. And I think this is Pericone, a Pericone MD Cold Plasma Plus 
that. I don't know. I guess it's like a neck cream or something. And I never tried a pore shrimp. So um, this would be interesting to try. Um, I never think I never thought that I needed to try one, but I wouldn't mind. This is the Valentino um, perfume. And then this Becca Zero No Pigment Virtual Foundation. This is interesting. I saw too much mouth um, do a video on this. I have to watch it again to see what she said. But anyways, that's everything in that bag. Like I said, when you purchase a perfume, you get like a free, you get to choose a robe or a blanket. So, of course, I chose a robe. It's so cute and pink. So cute. I'm not keeping this. I'm giving this to my aunt. She's going to gift this to someone else. I have enough robes. So, you guys know that I brought that lipstick robe. So, I don't need it. All right. So, let me show you guys the perfume that I brought. I've been wanting this perfume since forever. This perfume is my aesthetic you guys know i love black i picked up the ysl black opium perfume okay listen i've been wanting this so long like y'all just don't understand the name the packaging this is so me i got the three um fluent ounce um i probably could have got the one ounce but i just went ahead and got it and i used a coupon um so that helped the original price um I think it's 126 but with my coupon it was just a hundred dollars so you guys oh my god this is beautiful i just love the packaging so pretty it looks a little manly to me and that's why i like it like this look like a manly packaging i'm gonna spray some on mm. This smells so good. Um, it did come with a makeup bag. And the makeup bag looks so much bigger online. I was super excited for it. But this is what it looks like. It's so cute. It comes with the little mini perfume. Here's the mini one. Let me show you guys what it looked like against the girl. That's horrible. <laughs> that is so small. Yeah, I think I'm going to give this to my aunt because... I'm not, when, not going to put this in my purse. I guess it's meant to travel with, but... I'm not gonna use this. Um, I mean, it would come in handy, but I'm more of a body spray girl. I like to keep that in my purse. So, yeah, that's that's everything that I got from Ulta, and like I said, that's my very first perfume. But my next purchase would um, be um, Flower Bomb. So let me show you guys what I got from uh, Juvia's place. So I did pick up three glosses. I did show you guys that I picked up one of their glosses in my last haul or something like that. Um, so I did pick up three shades. I picked up um, the glass gloss. It's just a clear gloss. I don't need to swatch a clear gloss, okay? But this is what it looks like. I picked up the shade Kiss Me. I've been having my eye on this. But I was a little disappointed because I thought the gloss was gonna look like the box. I want the color that's on the box. And then I did pick up the shade Caramel Rose. And this one is sealed, but that Kiss Me is not, which is really weird. But this is Caramel Rose, really pretty, right? Nice brown color. I can't wait to try this. Ooh, oh my God, that is pretty. The camera not doing it justice. If you have this shade and you know why, I'm like, ooh. That is beautiful. I think all this stuff on um, Black Friday, but. Um, so I got the new Yami Angelina Times Juvia's Place palette. This was an impulse buy. Like I got it the minute it launched. I didn't know nothing about it. Well, I don't think nobody did, but <laughs> I'm not sure. But yeah, I just got it the minute it launched. And she has some beautiful looks. Like I do love her eyeshadow. Like her stuff looks so flawless and airbrushed. I want to get that good okay she does a really good job the packaging <sighs> juvia's place packaging is beautiful anyway but look at that look at her hair and the baby hairs like come on now <sighs> that is beautiful that looks just like her um and that is the uh, packaging and these are the colors <laughs> This shade right here is beautiful and that that um yellow swatch pretty nice and i have seen 
um, a few people use this and it looks so good. Then I did pick up the Nubian Glow Palette. I remember when these came out and I was like, hmm. This one I wasn't really impressed about. It looked better online than it do in person to me. Um, but I mean, it's still pretty. It's a pretty palette. I'll swatch some shades. Yeah, those are some of the shades right there. Sorry, that's a bad angle. I'm more impressed with the Nubian Royal palette. This is the one that I did want when these came out. Then I was like, you know what? I just wait till it go on sale or something. So I love it. I love this palette. This is a really nice combination. This is the shade that I want to swatch. Beautiful. Beautiful palette. All right, so that is everything that I got from Ulta and um, Juvia's Place. So yeah, I do plan on going back to Ulta pretty soon because I got some coupons and I want to use them up before the 24th, which is the last of the day. So you guys probably will get another Ulta haul in a vlog or something. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys comment down below and make sure you guys subscribe, of course, and I'll talk to you guys in another video. Bye.